Hey there, adventurers! Today, we're diving into the fascinating world of seals. We'll learn what makes them such amazing creatures, ask all the questions you've been curious about, and hear incredible stories from Sammy the Seal himself. Let's get started! Sammy, thanks for joining us. Ready to answer some questions? Ready as ever. Fire away, mate. All right, Sammy, how many types of seals are there? We've got around 33 different kinds of seals out there. From harbor seals to elephant seals and the mighty leopard seal, each one is unique in its own way. Some seals, like the harbor seal, love to stay close to the shore, while others, like the Weddell seal, venture under thick Antarctic ice. Every type of seal has special adaptations that make them perfectly suited to their environment, and that's what makes our seal family so fascinating. Why do seals have whiskers? Ah, uh, our whiskers are like magic sensors. They're super sensitive and help us detect the movement of fish in the water. Even in the darkest depths, we can find dinner. How long can seals hold their breath underwater? We're champion breath holders. Most of us can stay underwater for up to 30 minutes, but some seals can last even longer. It's all thanks to our super efficient lungs and blood that stores lots of oxygen. What's your favorite food? Oh, it's hard to pick. I'd say fish is my go-to meal, but squid and octopus make for a tasty treat too. How fast can seals swim? We can zoom through the water at speeds up to 25 miles per hour. It's all thanks to our streamlined bodies and powerful flippers. Why do seals spend so much time on land? Well, we need to rest, warm up and take care of our pups. The sun feels great on our fur and being on land helps us stay safe from some ocean predators. Can seals live in both warm and cold places? Absolutely! You'll find us in freezing Arctic waters and on warm beaches like those in California and South Africa. We're very adaptable! How do seals stay warm in icy water? Our secret is blubber. It's a thick layer of fat under our skin that keeps us toasty in cold water. It acts like a built-in winter coat, insulating us even in freezing waters. Plus, our fur has two layers. The underfur traps heat, and the outer layer repels water so we don't get soaked. When we dive, the blubber also helps us stay buoyant, so it's like having a life jacket too. Without blubber, surviving in cold places like the Arctic or Antarctic would be impossible for us. What's the biggest seal? The elephant seal takes the crown. Males can grow up to 20 feet long and weigh as much as a small car. Do seals have predators? Yes, we do. Sharks and orcas are our main predators in the water. And let me tell you, those guys are fast. That's why we've learned to be speedy swimmers and stay in groups for safety. Orcas or killer whales are especially clever hunters. But on land, we're pretty safe because most predators can't reach us there. It's all about knowing where to go and sticking with the herd to protect ourselves. How do seals communicate? We're quite the chatterboxes. We bark, grunt, and even slap the water with our flippers to get our point across. Each sound has a different meaning, like calling for pups, warning others of danger, or even just saying hello. And it's not just sounds, we use body language too. A quick head bob or flipper wave can speak volumes in seal communication. It's like having our own secret seal language. Why do seals sometimes look like they're clapping? It's not just for show. Slapping our flippers can be a way to warn others or even to have a bit of fun. How do seal pups grow up? Seal pups stick close to their moms for the first few weeks. They drink rich milk that helps them grow quickly. After that, they're off exploring the world. What's the funniest thing seals do? We love to play. Sliding down icy slopes or popping up to surprise each other is a favorite pastime.
Can seals sleep underwater? Yes, we can. We float and rest, coming up for air automatically. It's like a built-in alarm clock. What makes seals important to the ocean? We keep fish populations balanced and play a big role in the food chain. Plus, our presence shows the health of the ecosystem. Can seals survive storms? Absolutely. We're built tough. During storms, we find shelter near rocks or under the water to avoid the rough waves. What's the most unusual thing seals do? Sometimes we like to balance rocks on our noses, just for fun. It's like our version of juggling. How do seals navigate underwater? Our whiskers and sharp eyesight help us navigate. Even in murky water, we can sense changes in currents and find our way. Do seals have friends? Well, of course. We're social animals and love hanging out in groups called colonies. We even recognize each other's voices. How far can seals swim? Some of us travel hundreds of miles to find food or migrate. We're like the marathon swimmers of the animal world. Can seals see in the dark? Yes, our eyes are adapted to low light, which helps us hunt at night or in deep waters. What's a baby seal called? A pup. Seal pups are born with soft, fluffy fur and spend their early weeks learning from their moms. Do seals ever get cold? Not really. Our blubber and fur keep us warm, but we do enjoy basking in the sun to stay cozy. How do seals avoid predators? We're quick swimmers and can dive deep to escape. Plus, we often stay in groups to watch out for danger. Do seals have good hearing? Oh, yes. Our hearing is fantastic, especially underwater. We can pick up the faintest sounds from far away. What's the best part about being a seal? The freedom of the ocean. We get to explore, play and live in some of the most beautiful places on Earth. That's amazing, Sammy. Any advice for kids? Just this. Always stay curious, adventurers. The world is full of incredible wildlife waiting to be discovered and every action you take, whether it's picking up litter, learning about animals or sharing what you know, helps make the world a better place. And remember, the ocean is full of surprises, just like us seals. Wow, adventurers. What an incredible journey we've had today. From diving deep into the world of seals to learning about their amazing lives, we've discovered just how fascinating and important these animals are. But before we wrap up, let's take one last look at what makes seals and learning about wildlife so unforgettable. Seals are more than just adorable. They're a vital part of our oceans. Their presence keeps ecosystems balanced, and their incredible adaptations remind us how amazing nature can be. Whether it's their powerful flippers, their playful spirit, or their ability to survive in extreme environments, seals are true ocean superheroes. And you know what's so cool, kids? By watching this channel and learning about real animals from around the world, you're becoming a nature hero too. Every time we learn, we take a step closer to protecting our planet and the amazing creatures that call it home. Sammy, before we say goodbye, is there anything else you'd like to share with our adventurers? Just this, always stay curious, adventurers. The world is full of incredible wildlife waiting to be discovered and every action you take, whether it's picking up litter, learning about animals or sharing what you know, helps make the world a better place. And remember, the ocean is full of surprises just like us seals. Thank you, Sammy, and thank you, adventurers, for joining us today. 
Learning about seals and their amazing lives has been such an unforgettable experience. Don't forget to subscribe to our channel for more incredible animal adventures. Until next time, keep exploring, keep learning, and keep making the world a kinder place for all creatures great and small.